Rapper Nelly was arrested yesterday on suspicion of rape. Two teens charged with raping a 14-year-old classmate is an illegal immigrant. What people can do to women in the name of honor and treating women as property, not as human beings. It happened on Friday night when their car was stopped by a gang of robbers. The gang robbed the family, beat up three men and gang raped the woman and her daughter for hours. A child sex predator attempts to rape an eight-year-old in Columbia. It was all caught on video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 As the girl sees this, she imagines a firefly lighting up the night. She looks down at her hands and finds herself bleeding. She feels confused and worried. She looks up and sees a creature jumping from the bridge into the river. As it jumps, the girl thinks of a kite hooked to her skin. It was the most beautiful thing the girl had ever experienced. The girl enters a subway train. She takes this train every day and cherishes the people she rides with. She sees a shadow in the corner. When she looks closely, she realizes it's the same shadow that follows her whenever she rides the train. To avoid this discomfort, she decides to walk. On empty, dark roads, she feels free and liberated. The shooting star in the sky somehow shows her destiny. She feels it's the best day of her life. Until... She finds the dark shadow following her. The girl is petrified to see the shadow again. She starts running to get away. An unbearable pain arises in her. She looks down and finds herself bleeding again. The girl is traumatized by the shadow chasing behind her. The blood leaks from her body onto her leg and drizzles on the pavement. The shadow follows the red flashing marks and chases her down. The shadow knocks the wind out of the girl and drags her by the dumpster. Her soundless screams roam around the city. The girl lays on the ground motionless, but the constant jerk from the shadow keeps her consciousness awake. The girl is infected by the shadow. She goes home and looks at herself in the mirror. Her pain is taken away and the Red River is stopped. She thinks her life is pointless and that she has completely misunderstood it. At that moment, she decides to take her life to the star. A girl stands on the bridge looking down at the river. She sees a blinking animal sitting on the rock looking at her. She thinks it's the last thing she'll ever see before she goes to the star. At that moment, she jumps. As the girl falls, visions flash through her mind. Among them are a firefly, a kite, and a red light. Before she hits the water, the girl wishes she could see these visions forever. She wished that her random imagination would continue to find its meaning. She wished that her last day might just have occurred as any other. And as she entered the water, she wished that maybe, just maybe, I wish I had bled.